The report is sponsored by Anderson Plumbing, Heating and Air. Nobody wows clients like we do. You know, I'd just be happy with like a, a mill or two. Why I'd not? be happy if it paid for the cost <laughs> of my ticket. 1.8 million, not bad. I know exactly where that gas station oh, really? is. Yeah, I filled gas over for us next to the Target. So congratulations. Did you buy a ticket there? I have in the past. Not oh, this no. one. So it's definitely not <laughs> me. I'm not going on vacation anytime soon. All right, 8.07 right now. Let's take a look outside. Looking over at downtown and El Cajon. Happy Sunday. Hopefully you had a great Saturday. We were off to a very cool start this morning, and it continues to be cool right now as we continue on with our 8 o'clock hour. Ramona, you're in the upper 30s right now. Julian at 46 degrees. We're still stuck in the upper 30s there in Escondido and El Cajon. A little bit warmer if you're hanging out uh, along the coastal communities. All right, our rain future cast. Most of today is going to be dry. We saw some of that green passing through in the evening hours, so we do have a chance of some light pop-up showers later on tonight. Accumulations will be pretty minimal. Most of tomorrow should be dry, and it's as we get toward later in the week that we actually have several more chances for some rain. Now we could see some precipitation as early as Tuesday evening and then Wednesday, Thursday into Friday on and off showers here for the second half of the week. Enjoy today because it is going to be much cooler by Wednesday. We're also going to see those strong westerly winds pick up by the middle of the week and we're talking about snow once again, where at this point we are expecting some of the lower snow levels by Thursday into Friday. The National Weather Service reporting that the snow levels could drop below 3000 feet, so that includes Julian and places even lower than that because Julian right now is about uh, 4000 feet, a little bit more than that. Your forecast highs for today, lots of 60s on the board. Overall, fairly pleasant. It's nice if you have outdoor activities. Again, if you are heading out this evening, just watch out because you are going to be dealing with a chance of those showers. Out of the 60s and then into the 50s by Thursday into Friday. It is going to be quite cold in our inland valleys. We're going from the upper 60s. We're going to drop down into the low 50s, potentially even the upper 40s, and that's for your daytime highs. Check out how chilly the mountains are going to be. Right now, no official winter weather warnings or anything like that, but it is still a couple days away, so if that changes, we will let you know about it. 72 and mostly sunny in the deserts today. Not a bad day to go take a drive out there.